It would be very likely to find them doing experiments with substances of suspicious toxicity. Not from a chemistry class standpoint, but in the sense of using themselves as guinea pigs. They were not only smoking the classic weeds, but also practicing more dangerous activities, such as inhaling solvents. In an attempt to mitigate the effects of the illness in Curtis's daily life, and let's never forget that this was back when medical knowledge about epilepsy was still light years behind ours, Ian was almost being used as just guinea pig, a little like back when he was using recreational drugs as a teenager. Different sorts of experimental cocktails were being prescribed to him in the hope of finding the magic pill in a true trial and error scenario.